Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to explain the drilling process in PLC by considering a typical example and also tell you how to draw ladder diagram for these type of operations. So this is the problem statement that we have and uh, at the first place let us go through these problems uh, part by part and try to correlate with the figure and probably that will give us a fair amount of understanding on how to approach these type of problems. So they've given us a sketch of the drilling process that requires the drill press to turn on only if there is a part present and the operator has one hand on each of these start switches. So basically we have two push button switches and uh, this drilling uh, operation should start only if there's a, a part over here that is recognized by the part sensor and both of the hands should be in the push button switches so only if both the push both the hands are used for uh, pressing the push button switches and the part is also available the operation should begin that is the drilling uh, operation it can be either for drilling uh, a specific uh, portion of uh, the part that is there or it might be a continuous process as well so this precaution will ensure that the operator's hands are not in the way of drill so that is why it's always uh, helpful to have uh, both the push buttons being pressed simultaneously by both the hands at once the sequence of operation requires that switches 1 and 2 and the part sensor all to be activated to make the drill motor to operate so they've asked us to draw the ladder diagram so this is possible only if there is a part uh, that is there that is recognized by the part sensor both the switches should be pressed simultaneously by using two hands consequently once that is done the drilling machine starts and it can be a punch process or it can be a continuous drilling operation and how do we draw a ladder diagram for this so once the process is very clear we will be able to draw it straight away so this is the ladder diagram for this question so if you carefully observe we have two push button switches pb1 and pb2 and if we are manually pressing both of them simultaneously in this particular fashion both the coils will actually get energized so these are normally open contacts and they will be open circuited when there is no energy given to them and once we are actually energizing them they act as short circuit consequently current starts flowing through this path and the rung also gets energized and if there is a part in place consequently what happens the sensor detects it and it becomes equal to uh, one that is logically high state and gets activated in this particular fashion and the rung corresponding to it also will be energized and current flows through the motor and the motor gets energized once the motor get energized what happens the a uh, drilling gun actually starts working and uh, the desired operation according to the drilling process can be achieved so this is typically uh, looking like a three input AND gate so in case you have missed out the explanation of our AND gate ladder diagram please to watch it it will give you a fair amount of understanding with respect to these type of processes i hope uh, this problem is very easy and straightforward and you were able to understand it in case you have any questions feel free to reach out by typing in your questions in the comment section below if you like this video please do like it subscribe to our channel for regular updates thanks for watching this video please to keep supporting thank you